back to the channel. Hey guys, welcome to another video. Yana the Bean here. Uh, in this video, it's gonna be the part three to reading my stories on Wattpad. So this is pretty much part three of the goddess. If you haven't seen the other two videos, I'ma link them up there so you can go watch them before you watch this one. Or you know, I could just easily recap it. So let me do that. To recap, my main character, Athena, she got in a car accident, died. Then she was sent to, it's kind of like a Greek mythology type thing. So she was sent to Olympus and Zeus gave her a catch that she can get her life back if she can get her childhood uh, crush to fall in love with her by the end of the week. So, yeah. And so far, her childhood friend, Miles, has gotten a girlfriend. So, to conf conflict things even further, that's pretty much what's happening here. So, I am on day three Tuesday. So, let me just turn on my screen recording so we can get to recording this. day three Tuesday I'm gonna read uh probably four chapters so let's get started because they're really short so okay I wake up at home how did I get back here oh yeah if you guys didn't know she fell asleep at um she fell asleep at Miles house so I almost forgot but yeah good morning Athena dad says standing at my door oh good morning dad I say feeling confused you fell asleep at Miles' house, and I had to go get you. I looked down my phone. It's 7 o'clock. I'll be late for school. Today I have to buy prom tickets, and Veronica wants to go dress shopping with me. Thanks, Dad. I have to go to school now. I say getting out of bed. Okay, I'll make you some breakfast. He says leave my room happily. I get dressed casually today since the outfit I wore yesterday didn't work. I decide not to wear a lot of makeup today, too. I've got four days left to get Miles to like me, even if he's got a girlfriend. I go down to the kitchen and Dad puts a plate in front of the chair I sit in. I wait down and look. I wait and look down at the burnt bacon and scrambled eggs. I think that's what I meant to say, but I don't know. Yeah, see, it should probably say he should really get some cooking lessons instead of he really gets some. Yeah, uh, typos. <laughs> anyway. I pick out my eggs and rest my chin on my hand. What's wrong, princess? He asks in a worried tone. See, probably called her princess because that's what my dad always called me. Still calls me that to this day, so. Funny little tidbit. But anyway. Nothing wrong, nothing's wrong, dad. I just don't want to go to school today, I say. Don't worry, today will be shorter than you think. I sigh. Dad seems to have all kinds of inspirational quotes logged into his head. Oh, I'm going uh, dress shopping with a friend after school today. I say taking a bite from the very crunchy bacon. Hey, the fact that she still ate that shit. <laughs> but have fun, but pick an appropriate dress, Dad says. Okay, Dad. I won't wear a revealing dress. I say with a giggle. He <laughs> so funny. Dad smiles at me and I smile back. Time to go to school now, he says, tossing my phone to me. I catch it and get up to leave. I guess Miles is not picking me up today. I walk to school and the day goes by quickly. After school, Veronica walks up to me in the hallway. You still want to go dress shopping with me? Veronica says. Yes, I brought my credit card. I say, oh, she got bank. Okay, Athena, bank, bank. But anyway, I follow Veronica to her sports car. It seems like everybody I know can drive but me. We get in the car and she drives to the mall. She parks her car in a handicapped spot and starts to quickly walk into the mall. That was a kind of a really fast paced chapter, but I already knew that was gonna happen. But why the hell is Veronica parking in a handicapped spot, yo? She wildly. In the sports car, too. That ain't right, yo. Day three, Tuesday part two, and all we see is a picture of a white dress. A girl with blonde hair and a white dress. Is that the prom dress she's gonna pick? We'll find out. First, we go to the plaza to get something to eat before shopping. Veronica gets salad and I get a hamburger and some fries. Cliche Veronica, popular girl. 
tell it. <laughs> I saw her to feel a little fat because of her. Jesus. So I was thinking we should buy the dresses first, then buy the shoes last. And last, we buy the accessories. Veronica says I have to take a bite of her salad. Sounds like a great idea, I say picking at my fries. So, how's you and Miles going? It's going great. He finally asked me to prom, Veronica says happily. I was hoping she would have said something bad about the relationship to make me feel better. As if there was a chance he would ask me to prom. Who am I fooling? Girl, it's like, you know, it's not like your life isn't on the line or anything. You know, just a little funny, silly thing. <laughs> anyway. Cool, are you guys gonna wear the same color? I asked with a fake with fake enthusiasm. Yes, we're gonna wear dark blue. So I have to find a dark blue 